This is your two-minute update here on MSUSpartans.com. I'm your host, Dave Ellis, and Saturday at 3.30, Michigan State and Ohio State will kick off the Big Ten football season. It's the second year in a row these teams will meet in the opener. Last year in Columbus, the Spartans throttled the Buckeyes, racking up nine sacks and 13 tackles for loss in a 10-7 win. But OSU quarterback Braxton Miller is off to a great start as a sophomore. He'll be a danger for the green and white. He's more in control. He's seen more as a leader, I'm sure. Uh, so all those things, I think, are you know, helping him grow as a player, and you've seen immense growth in a year. But he's a very exciting player, very, very dynamic player, and he makes him go. He says he's a tailback that can throw in the backfield because he can make you miss and do a lot of different things, run with power and, and then throw it. So he'll be a, a tough guy to defend. Volleyball hits the road for a midweek matchup at Nebraska Wednesday. You can watch the match live at 8 p.m. on the Big Ten Network. Head coach Kathy George knows Lincoln is a tough place to get a win. Um, it is an experience, and it's one that uh, we experienced for the first time last year. So going back there, we, we'd like to, to handle that better than we did last year. We went in, and we were swept in three. Um, it's our intention to go in there and uh, battle uh, to, to do a much better job than we did in the, in the past. If you're looking for something different to watch Friday, stop by the outdoor pool at IM West at 5 p.m. where the swimming teams will host Wisconsin out in the elements. We did one last year and we're doing one this year. Hopefully we can do it every year because we open it up and um, it's, it's free and people kind of come in. We'll have stands and everything. And last year when we did it, it was in October and it was 80 degrees. Actually, it was really hot. And it's supposed to be nice weather on Friday too. And congrats to men's soccer player Tim Kreutz. His goal and assist against Western Michigan earned him Big Ten Offensive Player of the Week honors for the first time in his career. The Spartans open the Big Ten season Sunday at home when they face Northwestern. Full press conferences are available on the individual sport pages. That's your two-minute update. I'm Dave Ellis. You give us two minutes, we'll give you the Spartans.